Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October 10th of 2022 well, it is titled A Double Lunar Analemma Over Turkey. So what do we see here? Well, this is, or I should say, what is an analemma? We've seen pictures of these for the sun before. And it is that kind of figure eight pattern that occurs when you take an image of the sun at the same time of day, each day, or at least at regular intervals over the course of a year. And that allows us to see the changing position of the sun at the same time. However, you don't want to do it exactly the same with the moon because the moon is in a different orbit and it doesn't get back to the sun, same place in the sky every day. In fact, it will come 50 about 50 minutes later each day. So now you have to look at it not only taking the picture each day, but you've got to add that extra 50 minutes to allow the moon to get back into the same position relative to other objects. Now, what we can see is that we do see the same kind of figure eight pattern, although the upper portion is very faded and hard to see, uh, mainly because some of the phases up there are hard to see and are the new moon and very thin crescent phases. Those are difficult ones to image because not a lot of the portion of the moon is illuminated. And in fact, you can see the full moon dated in there for July the 28th of 2022. So we can label the dates for these as well. And you can see that there were phases, full phases off towards the left hand side and towards the lower areas. And in this case, crescent phases were towards the upper and the right hand side phases of our moon. So we get to see that now the analemma occurs because of the orbits and the tilt of the orbits. So that will give the specific pattern. So an analemma of our sun will have one pattern on Earth, but will look different on other planets if you were to do the same thing. Taking them one of their days later, we would see a different pattern because each planet is tilted by a different amount. And each planet has a more or less elliptical orbit. So if more elliptical, this will get more stretched out uh, wider. And a less elliptical orbit would be less stretched out because that's the difference between what we'd get where we expect it would be 50 minutes later, in this case for the moon, and where it actually ends up. So sometimes when the moon is further away, it's moving a little bit slower. So it won't quite get back to the same spot in time. Other other times when the moon's a little closer to Earth, it will get back too quick and pass that area. So that's why we get this stretched out a little bit based on the ellipticity of the orbit of the of that we are looking at. So that was our picture of the day for October 10th of 2022. It was titled a double lunar analemma over Turkey. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.